Inda, Marvini, Julie K. It's a reunion of sorts. <laughs> it is, right? Yeah. Because I've seen, like, you have quite a lot, but I've seen yeah. more on Kamsa. You and yes. Kamsa could have a sponsor band. Like, we're punk, now we're punk. He doesn't have a matric. No, I, I, yes, I heard that. I heard yeah, that. Yes, he always been he a went to Bordeaux um, primary. primary. Yeah? <laughs> I got on my loose. He's a lost, he's a lost sheep. Can I raise my hand for this one? This is a classic example. <laughs> I have to. Rose of change, Papa! <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. They've penetrated us. <laughs> they are here. <laughs> they are here. However, In my shower. I'm like, I can, I can uh, feel them. You're just projecting from a place of knowing that within you, you would not be able to handle and tolerate such embarrassment. <laughs> Maybe it's embarrassing for you, but maybe he's not embarrassed. Maybe he's yeah, like, yo, that's that. Uh, there's no audio playing. Nope, you just start, oh, you just, just talk. Start. Yeah, like okay. we'll start already. <laughs> this is the one to start. Is this the start? This is the start. Hinda, Marvini, did I do the key? You tried, that's cool. I that's tried, cool. I tried. Cool. Also, Mutona <laughs> sitting in for uh, Mac. Uh, everybody's here, right? Soul's here? Yeah, yeah. No, who's that? Yeah, what's going yeah. on? No, who's that? Hey man, yeah. hey, fugus. Oh, fugus. Yeah, but you're doing well, you look amazing. Oh, thank you, baby. I love thank the you dreadlocks, so man. The, the, what do they call them? These the, the, the black dogs. going to grey. Black going to grey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank oh, you so much. Beautiful. Thank like Fanella, man. Gia Bonger. Hmm. Ghost Lady is here. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Hey, Dudu me. is here. Black Studio is here. Fact Checker is here. And Bans, Piwe Angu. Which one, my guy? Which one? Which one? Piwe Angu. There we go. Everybody's here. Yeah. How are you doing? Good, man. Long time, bro. It's been a while. Yeah, it's been a minute. Shit, it's, it's a, a reunion of sorts. <laughs> it is, right? Yeah, yeah. been a minute, man. Yeah, yeah. Good. Yeah, yeah. You've been keeping well? I have been, I have been. I've just been a little bit busy working. I'm trying to figure shit out yeah. outside of the employment chain, yeah, um, yeah, in yeah. the self-employment chain. Yeah. Um, so um, self-employed chain rather. So I'm trying to just work, man. Stay yeah. to my grind, keep my head low, nice. keep focused, build nice. something. Nice. You know, yeah, do what you guys do. Oh man, that's Mind great. Mind your own business every day. I've been waiting for the call to be on the sex podcast. Way, wait, dude, I've got Let a bone to pick with us. you. <laughs> dude, dude, I've got a bone to pick with you. A bone to pick <laughs> with you. Hi, bro. Yeah, it's a sex podcast, Pella. Not me a hair for Pella. Not me a hair. Yeah, not me a hair for Pella. I feel like they, they come ready for sex there, you know. It's engaging and talking about it. A hundred percent. Wait, wait, wait. So you don't have a bone. Oh, hey, hey, no, 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 it's not that type. Okay. Oh, it's not that kind of party. It's not. It's not that kind of podcast. Do no, you, no. I heard her saying you, you want to give blowjobs from here to there. <laughs> I, I, no, no, I, no. no I we're we're not that jobs. kind of party. You want to gift people blowjobs from here to there because mm. you gifted him a blowjob, no? Mm. Oh, oh, oh. No. Who'd be willing to take a blowjob on the on the thing? No, we're not Should that kind of party. It? No, we're not. We're, we're not that kind of party. No, <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're not about to be gifting blowjobs anytime soon. Gankalani, please no. <laughs> okay, mm. but you're here so for no. Have me on the show. Now we're going to have a show. So you're so Yes. <laughs> Yo, we're having a lot. <laughs> we're no, having no worries, a lot. man. That's yeah, doing man. well. Nice one, man. Yeah, man. Ghost yeah. lady, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You've hey. never met. Oh, we've yeah, never met. We've never. never met. Wow. Yeah, I've never it's my met first that. time. I'm also like, who's ghost lady? Yes. The secret safe. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, 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 that's her. Yeah, yeah, nice to meet you. Are you impressed? A lot of people tend to be impressed when they see her. Well, I quite am. I mean, she does suit the voice. What I do like is that she wears her eyeliner the same way I wear yes, mine. Yes, we've got Stop something things. in common. Yes. Stop yes. Stop yes. Oh, nice. What you got for us, baby? What do I have? We're already going to the question on the yes. stories. Yeah, yes. I still want to talk Amazing. about Dini. You like, talk I have a whole lot. You have a whole lot? Let's talk about Dini, yeah. Shoot. Okay, last time. I'm like, okay, when, when? Okay. So, oh, no. No, no, the last time uh, we had Uwaris and also he had his pandler. So we asked him, yeah. like, what was his pandler for? Like, yeah. when it was, it, with his pandler. Yeah. So I'm like, ah, oh, Dini is like rocking like pandler yeah. after pandler, you know? Oh, damn, yeah. What's up? So, e pandler Zami for me are a reminder of the sacrifices I have to continue making mm. on my spiritual journey. Okay. You know? 
<clears throat> and it's not just the sacrifices in terms of sacrificing animals and imisebenzi and stuff like yeah. that. Yeah. But like just sacrifices in personal discipline, you know, in areas of my life that are important. For isn't those amuti slale zihamba gashle. No mazi ngaba kingiko ngopa zihlale zihamba ngolayin. So yeah, it's just that reminder. Yeah, it's a spiritual thing. Yeah. So what speaks to the number of them that you have? Because I've seen like, you have quite a lot, but I've seen yeah. more on Kamsa. You and yes. Kamsa could have a sponsor band. Like, you <laughs> <laughs> panja, now you <laughs> panja. One man can walk up a pool. You got the panja walls. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I couldn't come to the panja, Vela. Um, yes. Ma, well, I mean, for me, Mr. Benz, uh -huh. you know, in a period of time, before a one or two or three ziwa, and then I mean, you miss a benzi, so he pandas amzi pum miss a benzi. Oh, okay, so yeah. every time we're not this part. Oh, yeah. okay, cool. Yeah. And how cool. long does it take for one to fall off? It depends. Hey, these ones have been here for a minute now. Oh, they're what's taking a, a while. A minute is like most of this year, yeah. these from Jan, actually. Yeah. Oh, is it? Is that last year, ziwe? The one fell by my car, I think about three, four weeks ago. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. It depends, yeah, it depends. So, Miss what do you do, Naso? Like, I think you just chuck it in the bin? Do you nah, bury it? What's nah. the pro protocol? I think to each their own. I mean, my protocol is to keep mine. I just beg them some. I just beg them some. I beg them some. I Yes, begin to witness to get but opening bazo zia salem sam. Snow who are one nagi. Yes, then we are covering in bed. Damn, mm, nagile. Wow. Mm. So now, Mokshaba, is it like, because I know different people, some people buy a eh, la, some buy a bong. Uh, mm. What reasons like umdanga shabela for? Minang says in bong. Beautiful. We are shaba ukeza, we are shaba ukela, we are shaba nogutolisa. Ooh. Yeah, we are shaba. No fear and your ooze tob and your ugbong. Minang says in Panzela, in Mang Pasang Pasela Ugbong, among Sabang Sabilugbong. I'm so really cool. So there's a lot of people, because I'm assuming the only way you're going to know that Milok Olisa is yeah. if you go consult. So there's a lot of people walking around owing their ancestors apologies. I don't think if you go and consult, if you're an honest person and you know that you're a shitty person, you know you've got shit to apologize to. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. you know, like you know. Like you know. Like imagine. You just know. Like you don't need to be going and dumbeni and have people throw bones. Like fuck that. Like you, you're a crappy person. You yeah. know when you're an asshole of a person. You've got some shit to go pray about. You You've got some shit to go and declare in the spiritual world to cleanse yourself and like seek apologies and apologies be, bespo be bestowed upon you on your behalf. Man, that would take some other emotional intelligence yes. you know, to snap out of your shitty personality yes. and say, man, I'm fucked up. I need to go Yebo. apologize. Yebo. Yo. Shitty people know How about those people? who apologize and go back and do the same thing and apologize again? What does that? Those are manipulators. Oh. <coughs> but ancestors, I'm assuming they're not dumb. They will. No, I don't think so. I just shy and I'm close. Yo, I got the way. So you how? When I just cut two wheel, but can't eat. Ah. Oh, it was my actions. Yes, but but can't eat. It was sometimes the results of my actions. Yes, but sometimes uma unga ma meli nyezenzo zako zonke ziyama. That's true. You get to the end of izenzo. Mm -hmm. You get to the end of. You, you, th there comes a point where it is beyond even your own power. You must just be still and listen to the change that is required of you. Yeah. And that shit is spiritual. I don't care who says what, but there is a power and a force that is greater than you that speaks so loudly in you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you know it inside that I, I need to listen now. That's true. That's true, yeah. To learn. To learn. To learn. And the unlocking is when you have surrendered and submitted to the to being the end of yourself. Like it is no longer upon me. Please help me. Yeah. Get this shit right. Because I remember, like, I did consult once, and I've given the guy's numbers <laughs> on on this podcast, you know. Yeah. And he told me something that there was no way he knew, right? And I was like, yo. It's then crazy. it was like, oh yeah, your mom and all of them are like, yeah, yeah. You fucked around, and they had to make sure I find out, you know. And they were yeah. like. Ah. They were like, no, that's real. They were like, oh, well, you fucked around and you found out. You yep. know what I mean? And they were like, all along, all the things that you went through, they were there knowing and they were like, oh, well, but you did get yourself here, which I did accept, and most then, importantly. Uh, but they're still guiding you. Yes. They're still there guiding yes. you, but they're like, okay, you fucked around. This is what you're going to need to go through. And when we eventually pull you out, you know better now. Otherwise... 
And you, and you know what the magic is? <laughs> you know what the magic is? You, they are waiting. It's like even how God works. God is waiting for you to just acknowledge. That's accept, it. Accountability. Yeah. Say yes. The magic is this. You need to hold yourself accountable. So because mm. you have done the ultimate sacrifice. Mm. That's why I need to, those ones are just manipulators. They're busy doing ceremony, ceremonies, apologizing, apologizing, going back to the same behavior. No, you need to come to an acceptance of your wrongdoing and of your changed behavior. That's true apology. That's atonement. No, if you haven't slaughtered your own pride. If you haven't hey. slaughtered your own pride, thank Profound. you. Yeah. Hey, Shia, Shia, Shia. You can slaughter your pride over what you But if it's not your own pride, you <laughs> don't oh. Drop the Shia. So, yeah, that's how this shit works, you know? I also want to know, so people, okay, since you spoke about your spiritual journey, yeah. like, do you take consultations? Is it, are you... I, I, no, I'm oh, okay. I'm still learning. I'm still learning. I think, you must be very careful because your people's lives are in your hands. You know, you are a vessel, Esiras, and... You're going to end up doing things that you're not going to end up doing. Then your things don't go according to plan. And then you're going to get So I, I, I don't want to be on the dark side of the fence with my spiritual journey. And to each their own. I'm still trying to understand my true calling. And I'm still trying to understand its truest placement. And I am here to help people heal from sexual traumas, emotional traumas, psychological traumas, and all of these things. I'm still learning and accepting that no man kume petroini and I've learned the Ngoma way. I am not a Ndumba girl. Oh, okay. You understand? So my practice is different. So I'm not yet open for business because I'm even still healing from the traumas from being inside a Petroen. You understand? So Yongi in Donje, I'm I'm getting myself right because I'm not even trying to bleed on patients. People's healing is a serious affair. Yeah. To me at least, you know? And I'm very sensitive about that thing. I'm not even trying to be on some, here's my msamo, watch me pass that. No, mm. no, 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 no. And also yeah. just, on, you see, um, you spoke about um, also um, believing in God, right? Mm -hmm. And so wh what do you request from God and, 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 and what do you request from the ancestors? The, what's the difference? So I, I'll speak for myself because I'm not too sure. Ukpasha is a very intimate process and hardly it has no witnesses. Mm. So I can't speak on anyone else's narrative. But my narrative is this. When I am in my God season, like now I'm in my God season. What defines a God season? A God season for me is when my focus is solely on God. Oh. The main source. Okay. I need to hear his assignment upon my life. Uh -huh. I need to listen to his calling upon my life. I need to isolate myself in ways that I can constantly be in a space to hear him. Okay. Mm. Right? And then when I'm in my ancestor season, yeah. I am asking for them to speak to God on my behalf. Mm. Oh. Because they are spiritual and because they transcend faster than a physical being, no wall can stop them. They are angel beings. Right? <laughs> All right. From his lap. So I speak to them like angels and I speak to them like messengers. I speak to them like wisdom keepers mm. because they've, mm. they know the journey. Mm. You know, I think a spirit is wiser than yours if you are still trapped in the flesh. Mm. The minute it dies, its value increases. Mm. See, so that's that's the difference between my my ancestors and God for me. Okay. He is the main source. Yeah, I have them because He at some point created their bloodline. Yeah, I form part of their bloodline, bloodline, and they lived before me. They prayed before me. They had mantras and everything else before me. This is just a spiritual legacy that I have inherited. Yeah. the same way I would inherit my parents' money if they if they cared to. The same way I would inherit a sister's car if she left it for me. Mm. It's an inheritance. It's, it's an inheritance. so deep. It, it's it's unique even. Mm. It can't be a blanket statement, almost like one size fits all. Yeah. That's an interesting question. Why? What do you ask from them? And what do you ask from, from God? God? Yeah. because yeah, I, I always... ask for God to talk to me so I can hear him. I ask from them to speak to him on my behalf. Mm. See what I mean? Yeah, yeah. 
Father, give me the assignment so I may know what to do with it. And I then the answer, and that's all I ask. So when the answer comes, in what way do you say, okay, this answer is coming from who? The answer can be both. It, it can be both. It, the answer comes from you must understand when we are praying and when we are asking for, yeah, we have a package in our mind that we envision will be delivered at our doorstep. Yeah. yeah. But God but God delivers messages, answers, prayers in different packages. Yeah, yeah. So you must always be awake in your interactions with either people, spaces, mm. and, 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 and. Yeah. Because in those interactions, True. so even through the touch of another human being, you may receive an answer. True. So always be alert. And that's why I'm in my God season, because I need to be listening right now. Mm. Yeah. I need, I need not be asking questions. I need to be listening. Listening. When I've seen and I'm confident that I've listened and I've heard, then I can start asking for guidance. Yeah. And I'm very careful. I don't ask for things. I ask for substance that builds character. What it, would it be wrong to ask for things? I don't think so. Okay. Not at all. If a thing is your need, yeah. go for it, ask for it, claim it, because that is what makes you feel complete somewhere in you. Mm. If you're going to ask for a car, please ask for it. If you're going to ask for a house, a property, please ask for it. Mm. But be careful that you're not asking emptily, if that's even a word. Mm. Make sure that you are also asking to be made into the character that can contain that and sustain the receive. blessing. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. yeah. I, I, yeah. I, I understand yeah. that. But I don't yeah. know, man. I, I, I sort of disagree with the... Not this, but mm -hmm. I don't think so. Of course, as spirits, we have spirits, yeah. right? And yeah. we are all spirits, but we're still within yeah. the flesh. If you're fucked up on earth, well, how is it that you gain this automatic wisdom once your spirit is separated from your body? Because all is forgiven in death. God doesn't punish us. Yes, you will not, will so not, our spirits are not condemned. <clears throat> but not condemned. How are they now automatically wiser? Or is it because they've encountered God now? I, I, I can't answer you because... True, you've never been I, there. I've not been there. That would be like automatic to go to. But what I, I, what I wanted to say was I can't answer purely because I've not engaged on this subject enough with people that have given me substantial answers enough mm. to be able to verbalize to you and, and contextualize exactly what the answer to that might be. Mm. But I can tell you I feel it though. Mm, okay. I can feel it. But can you have like a fucked up lozy, you know? I think there are turbulent spirits. Yeah. Or you like must a be... A, you, you could, yeah, you must... <laughs> careful who you're summoning. Wow. So that's why I'm going to tell Papa, is it lozy, moya, because take your time with it and do your research in your family. Mm. Ask about who's who in the zoo and even... Your temperament, ask where you get it from. Mm. Even your character traits, ask where you get them from. Mm. You must ask. Mm. That's why it pains me when children are put up for adoption and they've got no source of reference of things that they might later find confusing about themselves. But I am glad that they have family to belong to. Mm. to nurture who they might be mm. from the most organic source, which is your mother's womb mm. and your father's seed. See what I mean? Yeah. So um, ufuzo is a big thing. But what in the case where you don't know your biological mother and father and I, you generally just, yeah. these are the people I'm raised with and yeah. this is the family I I, I don't know. think you must burden yourself about it. Don't burden yourself about it. That's what it is. Mm. That's what it is. Appreciate, see the blessing in having a family mm. and a place to belong to, people to belong to. Mm. See what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, don't, don't, don't make a faff about it because you're going to steal some sweetness out of your life if you faff about it. Mm. That that was taken away from you has been replaced. Appreciate the replacement. Earlier on when she asked about like if, you know, uh, do you consult? And then you said no, because you're also going through, you're not ready, you're not there yet. Yeah. How does it happen that I want to like, are they, are they born witches or are they born witches and then there are those who are born to heal but found themselves crossing that line? I think people are naughty men. Or, or another thing, is it maybe sometimes it's the pressure of the clients? 
because that's another one. No, then you're oh, feeling no, no, kind, no, that's no, no, influence no. in meaning. Yeah, if, no. Uh, no, yeah, if, a lot if, of... If, <laughs> there are also feeling in Kulungansi. In Kulungansi helps me, he's the Minister of Health. And then you're going to go to Joe <laughs> so that's too soon. We are right now with the health Drops. department. We are, we, are, we are very skeptical. Hey, hey, good team. The boy can walk on your tail right ah, now. They got caught by a kid <laughs> with special weight. Let me know. Ish. Do you know that that kid has got like went to school for kids with special educational needs? Where? Yeah, it came out today, the story. <laughs> he doesn't have a matric. No, I, I, yes, I heard that. I heard yeah, that he was always in, been a he went to Bordeaux um, primary. Lose. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to my loose. He's a lost, he's a lost sheep. He's a lost <laughs> sheep. I'm going to my loose I'm fine. <laughs> I'm a tweaky. Like... So they tracked his name, guys, right? Because his name came TikTok out. TikTok is dangerous, guys. I think but, you know, guys, wild. TikTok. Bongani Matthew Lani. So they traced. Mm. And then he initially, man, he initially went to, do I have this? No way, Paco. I'm a police officer. Paco, do you want to talk about 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14? 7, 8, 9, 10. Ah. Ah. I know, but that guy's got mental issues, guys. Yes, because earlier so. on. He's very mental. Earlier on in his uh, primary school Life. Baba Milo to Norman, he's got learning problems, difficulties. Mm. And then Bamusa to a special needs school. Yeah. Ooh. You know, and then there he did, I think, three subjects, but also didn't do that well. And then Wapuma from the system, Wavela Saravela, adult school. School. Hey, that's what I think. He appeared at an adult school, like something, something, it's like a. A school for the adults, basically. Yes. Like he disappeared for four years and then appeared. So why didn't I appear Ranga Everts? I know, I've heard you. Already they denied him, yeah. Know, you, you can't go into like, <laughs> man, I don't get how, like, and also, I think people must be held accountable, man. Like, mm. who lives in that house with that kid? Because it's not his house. Too many people need to be held accountable yeah. for that nonsense. Like, there's too many loopholes everywhere. Yes. Like, everywhere, everywhere. Wait, how does you a talk about a house? Wh which house? H how does a person pass through so many systems? Yeah. How does, a, how does a person just pass through so many systems? Yeah. Never mind just the house, but... All these systems, I, I, no, I, I... I see this. this. We'll get to the systems, right? But within Enkini, when he's posting on social media that he's graduated, Bulega graduation gown clearly because he Does didn't he graduate from anything. Hey? Does he not live alone? Not... No, guys, I know, no, no, but, I, but I know okay, a shop where you can buy home, these... Right? But... The, yeah, alone. these graduation guns you can buy. You, you can, can buy them. Guys, yeah, even even people is. that post themselves in scrubs, I'm always saying, why do you believe that content? Why do you believe it? Like, you know how easy it is to edit yourself in spaces and places yeah. Uguzo, nowadays. He yeah. only I constantly be, had a stethoscope even, remember? Crazy. I could be literally just in KZN, right? Mm. Just in KZN, where there's palm trees and a cute little beach. And then I could clip it with other videos that I found elsewhere and be telling you guys I'm in Mauritius yeah. in a bikini. People can rent scrubs. People yeah. can do this, do that. Like, that's the thing about social media. Yo, we're so gullible. We believe anything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well... Tabo so is a perfect example. Yeah. He was in prison saying he's in New York. Yep. In Manhattan. Bruh. Eesh. You know what I mean? Yo. Bruh. Well, he's in the man's cell. <laughs> <laughs> he's not in Manhattan. <laughs> no, but what I'm saying is, I there's people... I want to press buttons. What uh, do I press for you? Okay, Anything. let me press. Just press, bro. Speed up, man. Eesh, his arms are short. Yes. Please take it, <laughs> take it closer to him. Like, push it closer. His arms are really short. And like, he's got uh, really short arms. Uh, push it closer to him. You press. Because she won't know. She's not familiar with it yet. I'm so not you familiar press. with it yet. Did you open it? Okay. Lovely. Okay, that's awesome. the one. Done. Yeah. Max Sun. I oh, I know you guys. Mom told actually, me the other day yeah, that Ziggy recorded yeah. that. Guys, I smoke weed, so I'm going to forget these, right? So you're going to remind me. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> I'm going to forget you. I'm not even listening. I'm so terrible at I my think job. You probably need two or something. <laughs> Even if you I'm scared of thinking like, ah, he's a couple of coffee lays. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Black coffee, black coffee, black coffee. Black coffee. He's a couple of coffee lays. I'm simply there. Yeah! Yeah! Okay, back to the crazy doctor. Yeah, yeah let's go. But what I'm saying is, Kanye, yeah. there's people who know this guy personally. 
Understand? Mm-hmm. Sorry. There's people who know this guy personally. Yeah. Why didn't they hold him accountable? Where are the people who are his friends? Nini and now he was coming out of a big Ford saying he just bought a brand new car. Remember, now, yeah. now. Yeah. It wasn't his car, number one. Oh who was goodness. the person recording him? Who was the person who borrowed him the car to lie on social media? Oh. You know what I mean? It's like if you don't know, man, you utiana sega i billione. What what I'll say now? I know you're lying, man. You know what I mean? And I'll, I'll go to his TikTok and be like, man, I know this guy. He's a cameraman. That's true. You know what I mean? He's lying. Yeah, that's true. So that's what I'm saying. Like, what about all those people? Like, they are fucked up as well, and they are as complacent and responsible as him for this lie. Yeah. Because this guy went on yeah. to 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 the department. I think worked with him or used him as an example because he was saying that doesn't th- even have HIV because he said it's HIV positive. That, yeah, he had a whole story. His story is... So I think he, there's I think there's two groups of types of people. Mm. He was in, infected in, by a boyfriend, by yeah. an ex, yeah. like um, with HIV and obviously it was a traumatic story and because that's how his rise was. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is that, okay, that's how he just Is died. this true? Because there's also pathological we liars. Now. We, we don't, don't know now. There's sociopaths, there's pathological liars, there's... So many different groups. You would even of... enter hospitals. You see, like, I just Helen Joseph. Guno Muntu or Octala support Mundo so Sega Catel. Maybe they've given up. There are these the people in, in, in a person's life, you know, people that are just yeah. like, I think yeah. again, I, we, we can't anymore. For them to be sane, it's yeah. at least they don't, they're not crazy towards us. I'm yeah. crazy, like Pagu Internet, not us. Not us. Yeah. Then there's enablers, I guess. Ish. And then the enablers, we don't know what's wrong with them, but they're yeah. running with this lie I'm and they're man. just, they're hype men. Mm-hmm. I mean, for them, it's exciting. But <laughs> guys, it's, a, it's exciting, yeah. You know, like these white lies and stuff and see how far you can take it. But yeah. when you start to prescribe medication, when you start to <laughs> give diagnosis, when you start to tell people, good man, and then you even launch your own pharmaceutical brand that supposedly is healing things and stuff. And so what was in there? Can I raise my hand for this one? This is a classic example. <laughs> I have to. Bros of change, <laughs> Papa! <laughs> Yeah, Dineo, you have to raise your hand before you talk, please. This is so wild. Good radio stickers. It's a thing that we do. I mean, good radio because of. It's Speaking curtain. over someone yeah. on the radio sounds more horrible than yeah. now. Yeah. And now, obviously, someone will stop on you. Yeah. And also, there's no need because we're not out of time. You know, radio, there's yeah. one of the shows. How did much, you feel, too though, much you know, discipline about that in, whole... Uh, I, d- I didn't give a shit, really. Okay. I just yeah. got off Twitter and yeah. I moved on with my life. And this is exactly what I said to Saul. I'm not going to get involved. I literally spent yeah. the, the entire yeah. time... Yeah. Seven yeah. I, had, I, w- I had no engagement on Twitter. Yeah, I did true. not even want to know. Okay. That's how intense my focus gets. She didn't when even I have Twitter on her phone. I didn't even. I was just focused on what we knew was the truth, you know? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what I needed to focus on. That's all you need in life. So this guy is a classic example of what happens when people with mental illnesses are enabled and are not held accountable at an early stage of seeing that there's something wrong. Because people with mental illnesses are so intelligent, you must understand. I'm telling you now, because there are no boundaries in that mind. But is it right to call... Because I, 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 remember when this... Now it's nah, even man. We know what she means. That's a PC term. I, I'm, nah, I'm, I'm, I'm not even. What, I'm not even. I'm not even part of the very overly sensitive people on social media yeah. right now. Like you, got, you guys are gonna have to like literally oh yo back. Yeah, that's just a because PC. We know what she means. Yeah, we know what we, you we mean. We must be ourselves. Say, yeah. Yeah. We can't be afraid to be ourselves. Okay. Okay. And in the midst of wow. Was I was I not was I not having a meltdown just now in the month of May? What did I birth from that? Mm. Am I struggling? Mm. Do you see me suffering? Mm. Am I working? Am I saving myself? Mm. I'm fucking smart, bruh. Mm. I'm fucking smart. Not even book smart, whatever. I'm just spirit smart. Like, I'm smart. Yeah. There's something about... I get what you mean. You see what I mean? I and mean. unfortunately, yeah. I'm South African and I like Isuzulu. So, Yeah. <laughs> You know, yeah. that's just what it is. And when people that have mental illnesses are left to their own devices all the damn time, those people will manipulate you. Yes. Yeah. They will yeah. manipulate yeah. you because yeah. Abbas born, you born. Yeah. So you need to hold them accountable all the damn time. You need to be barking in their ear. 
calling them out on their nonsense all the time. Mm. But unfortunately, in this case, because of people were just glorifying him, thanking him. Because remember, even when he has this diagnosis, or yeah. maybe he's giving people like um, what to do if you've got this. Yeah. He would literally be reading these things off Google. So it, it was, I think obviously he loved the, thank you so much, doctor. And because obviously now it's like I'm being acknowledged, that, yeah. you know, I'm being respected. He needed that. So that's why it kept, kept it going. We didn't know. It was, again, I think it goes back to the people who are with him were supposed to hold him accountable nah. or to even just stop the crazy and say, ah, 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 unamanga, we know what you're doing. Expose him for that matter. I think you give him too much credit, man. It's just someone who's mentally disturbed. You know, I, I don't think we we can get into that mind and try to make sense of things and psychoanalyze yeah. it. You know what I mean? Mm, I you're thinking you. of it from a sane uh, a point of view and from yeah. a sane, sober mind. Mm. He's... You how how do you rationalize with you know some somebody like that? But remember how many people have believed him and really thought that he is who he says he is, it's and now they feel stupid. It's unfortunate. So obviously, it's some like, even bought Amma Billy. Yes, yes. yes, it's unfortunate. You know? It's a hard pill to swallow now. It's <laughs> a hard pill to swallow. <laughs> it's a tough pill for real. So now we take AP from you. Two. Oh, no, it's a nuclear five. <laughs> they've got a pharmaceutical car. It's unfortunate. It's our code, guys. <laughs> Do you know, I want the people who actually the used the, these abapilis because they were two for umkaba, right? So, like, did the, it help anyone? Are there I people wonder. out there who got the... T- and they're like, ah, at least... They probably have diarrhea. Isn't it a shit show? Oh, placebo effect. <laughs> also, because he's going to say, oh, umkaba, but listen, stop the alcohol, eat more <laughs> yes. veggies. And you, of course, will That's like umkaba. True. You know what I mean? Because yeah. of... It's not even the pills. No, you actually my thing, lose because but of most of those pools, that's what they do anyway. Yeah. They tell you, they give instructions. It's a lifestyle change. It comes with a diet. Yes, yep. most pools are that's like that. That's how they stay but... safe. On yeah. the legal side of the fence, you can't sue us. I mean, yeah. you know, we've already told you. Did you eat? Did you follow yeah. the diet? <laughs> da, 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 da. Well, you didn't. So it's not the pill. Yeah, it's you. So, I don't know if this is, please just double check it, fact check. Apparently there's a girl who lost her nursing job um, because of there was a... Th- uh, a conflict he had with uh, this doctor. The name on this thing on Twitter is... So you can bleep that out, obviously, because it's someone's name, but for the uh, you know, for trying to help you, obviously, get to this case. But apparently someone... I don't know if there was a, a conflict. Either she was trying to call him out. She works at, at a hospital. Um, and... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And she lost her job. Um... Yeah. I mean, I'm holding it here, the thing. Uh, so when, I don't know how this true. Happen? This is in 2021. Mm-hmm. There's a stamp here that says 2021 mm-hmm. Remember when um, there was a strike, like, like a couple of months back? I don't know actually how, how long ago it was. Um, and so he went, he, he jumped on the bandwagon of the the strike for doctors because they were not getting paid. You know, like the, the doctors in your government hospitals. Mm-hmm. So, and he got the CEO of, I, I don't know, one of the hospitals called him directly apologizing. talking about the same line. Yes, yes, Ulani. yeah. Jesus That's crazy. Lani. So He's another bester. He's a medical yeah. bester. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever doctor was happening, yeah, he, whatever that's happening, you know, around, he would adopt that issue and make it about himself. So that's what he went to on, on the, and acted like, well, if it was, well, definitely it was acting, like he's also affected, has not been paid, whatever it was, allegedly. And then, Chigi Chigi, the CEO of the hospital calls him to apologize and say, okay, please um, call the, contact this person um, who was in the HR department. Oh and then God. it just fizzled away. This is crazy. So I just Googled this. What do you call people that live lives that don't exist? Yeah. Right? Oh. Um, you call them a fantasist. This is someone who lives in a world of their own and doesn't have a firm grasp of reality. They may have a mental illness. Narcissists and schizophrenics fall into this category. <laughs> well, On the other hand, uh, T.S. Eliot said, humankind cannot bear too much reality. Love T.S. Eliot. Yeah, he's quite I've good. measured my life in coffee spoons. Ah. That's T.S. Ah. Eliot line, ah. yeah. She's That's been ringing the yeah. bell. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> um, to answer you, um, there's no other source in terms of the story with Homole. Apart from Homole Twitter. Was, be- Could be Twitter. fake news, so yeah. Yes. And then to just add on to the statement that Ghosty has stated, well, it hasn't been stated whether or not the department did sort out the issue. They just referred him to HR, but the video of him complaining mm. was removed not oh, long after. Yeah. So it could have been 
the fact that it was drawing attention that he did not need at that time because it was back in 2020 or 2022. Yeah. Hmm. Like, it's crazy because, like, with news, we're able to say, okay, a story may be all over the internet, but we we'll always check sources and stuff. Yeah. But with this guy, just because there's a doctor who's on TikTok with 200K followers, even producers on TV shows didn't bother checking if is this guy legit just because of the validation of, or he's been legitimized by social media, you know? So I think mm. it's a learning moment, obviously, mm. for everyone mm. to just mm. always go back and check the facts, no matter how someone has got a stamp of approval, <laughs> especially from TikTok, really, you know what I mean? Um, it's quick because now they're pressing charges. He's got lots of problems. He, he's Number got one, the problems. department is suing him. All these other, any company that has ever attached to them, uh, to him is going to, you know, oh, come okay. for him. Uh, uh, there's cho charges. People who he has given medical advice, I had liberty as well to press charges. Then when he was caught, he made a lie and said his... Um, Sanele or what Zingelo? Oh my goodness! That Zingelo is actually a doctor studied in Cuba. He's pressing charges for fraud, uh, theft. Huh. So the guy is in big shit. It could be going to jail. Because two jail days ago he was doing lives, you know, joining lives. I saw some clips, and I'm like, why is this guy even still talking? Did you see the video of his that's making rounds? You know, Doctor Lani of when he was trying to do a live, and then they they snubbed him during the live. Oh yeah, like they, they deactivated canceled him. His, his... Like they deactivated his account during. Of course, people life. were reporting him. He was like, "Yeah, you know, I feel, I feel," and then all of a sudden, <laughs> during the feelings, like gone. <laughs> his next life is gonna be in prison, <laughs> and prison is hell. And so he might Wild. see his dream there because he might have a, well, a, a boyfriend named Joseph. Now he'll be in hell and Joseph. <laughs> For real this time around. <laughs> but on the real though, he might not even go to jail because he's mentally disturbed. He's not, yeah. So if he's he mentally might... disturbed, that's on Musa Evesco PC. Obviously, while serving a sit. Because he's not of sane mind. That's this the thing. What so what are the implications legally? He's not gonna go to jail. Well, if he does make it to jail, not, he'll survive. He's not normal. I think he'll survive if he does make it to jail. He'll be a doctor there. They need fantasy there. Oh. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> I get a giddy fantasist. <laughs> yeah. No, I don't even think he'll make it. He'll just go to him. Because in court, firstly, they'll yeah. say, let's take him for, you know, yeah. uh, uh, analysis, analysis, psychoanalysis yeah. or whatever. And then they'll diagnose him that he's mentally not okay. Because he's not okay. He's a cooler. Like... Good doctor Akula, guys. Like, he needs help. <laughs> <laughs> like, for real. Like, so, like good doctor Akula. Like, ah, this guy. But yeah, man, it's messed up. But I think as a society, we need to take a long, hard look at ourselves in the mirror. Because it's TikTok that made him. People made him. You know, asking for advice and all these things without checking. <laughs> right? Guys who always got to... Doesn't miss a beat with a stethoscope. Yeah, he, yeah, no shame. He made sure. I think that was a, 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 a yeah. big sign. Like I, the way the stethoscope is like nah, used, man. I shame. It clearly it doesn't do what, what it's supposed circus. to do, but it had to appear on the lives. But what it's crazy it? though how we just take prescriptions from people without verifying them. That's mm. what I'm saying. Maybe that's just his bag. Yeah, we must check right. ourselves, eh? Yeah, we must like, check ourselves. Guys, we're too desperate, man. We act out of desperation in Disney. We need to chill. The you internet. This, this month is mental um, oh, awareness, awareness month. Yeah, yeah. international, yeah. Well, world oh, mental brilliant. health. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and it, it it says a lot. Like we, we, everyone needs to check themselves. We need to check ourselves. Like, like have those deep conversations with yourself. Like even what are we engaging on social media? Yes. What are you believing? You yes. Know? And don't try get a diagnosis on the internet. Be it no. trying to diagnose yourself, or you're asking from a doctor. Because even on the radio, when people, there's doctors there, people call in, I've been feeling this way, what's wrong with me? That's irresponsible, guys. It's your life. Put them up, please, from a month or and then what now? There's a trend of virtual consultations. Do you, do you buy into it? Mina, I, I don't, I'm not sure how I feel about a virtual consultation. With what, what con a doctor, a medical yeah, doctor? Yeah, like a medical doctor. But it started nah, obviously with COVID. Remember how obviously because of you can't, the face-to-face, -face, you know, <coughs> being pursed. Mm. Um, that's when this trend started. And obviously, and it depends what you have. Are you subscribing things, to it? No, no, no. I also don't subscribe I've to it. I've never, but I think there's certain things that can be diagnosed because no matter what doctor, there's times what doctor like, Bambi, I got biggest stethoscope. We have and they just ask you questions. Oh, it's, oh, it's okay, cool. Obviously, he's got a check. 
checklist of mm. questions he'll ask. You know what I mean? Mm. That he he asks this you pendu like I saw mm. it rules out certain yes, things yes, and yes. etc. Yes. But that's from experience and yeah. his knowledge. Ufundile, right? Yeah. So there's certain things, yes. But obviously, if I'm not gonna ask some a doctor online to yeah. uh, consult with them. I need to be seen, X-rayed, and yeah, stuff. Exactly. So I think on certain instances I would, I would. I've never done it though, but it would make sense on <laughs> like for you, flu yeah. you know. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Speaking about still on the topic of our doctor, I want to come back to what you said about um, traditional doctors, ne? Yeah. Um, and uh, witchcraft. I believe that if you are the kind of doctor that can be persuaded by your client mm. to do something that is unethical. You came into it unethical. Oh. In you, there's an unethical character trait that needs to be handled. We can't blame the patient. You understand? The, the patient must be, must be referred elsewhere and must be rejected. Not all clients are meant to be a part of your business journey. Mm. So like, if you know that you're practicing white spiritual ceremonies, white as in is mm-hmm. of the light, mm-hmm. right? You can't allow an evil presence to come into your spiritual safe haven. Yeah. And influence you, mm. deter you from your purpose and your calling to prescribe wrongly. You're unethical. Mm. You're uh, whoa. You're I've unethical. Quest- so yeah. I've got a question. Né? So, so obviously you're answering the question of Abandu who with gifts and then Swaba right? Yes, yes, yes. It's like if a doctor, if I go to a doctor, obviously doctors know poisonous substances and chemicals and what can yeah. kill you, what you can't, you know, uh, 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 induce ingest. or in, ingest yeah. rather yeah. as a person. And you go to a doctor and like, doctor, Mfuna upodi susban ban usban ban, and then the doctor then, then you get obviously if he's found out that he's administering poison, they lose their license. They lose their license. Do some almost lose a particular license or goodwill from ancestors once you are now have turned to black spirituality and it's like it's crossed over to yeah. the other side. I, I believe in karma. Yes, I believe that each dog has its day. Right, I do believe that. <laughs> yeah. Each, each, each action has a repercussion, mm-hmm. like n- without fail. I don't know when they come because, and you must ask, ask yourself at the rate that so many people are performing, like just dark things. Yeah. Man. I mean, even just, just, like, you, just, you run the things. risk of giving yourself vaginal cancer. You're putting muti up your vagina <gasps> just so you can keep a man or fucking better. Like for me, that's just wild. Wait, wait, you Don't wait. do that. Yes. There's, there's people that do that. There's people out there that are traditional healers that encourage this. They prescribe this. It makes me upset because we do so many wild things with such a beautiful, powerful gift. What if in that person's uh, um, person's, uh, opinion, they feel like it's a good thing? Mm. You must be careful which spirit you ingest. Maybe try brandy. So people put yeah, but, So stop dancing around in dark spirits and pretending to be a good healer. Can't do when a mouse mouse prepare when a wenza is into is nyama nawe. But I'm just, in that regard of as per- much as perpetuating yes, the darkness. That, but what if that person's opinion, they feel like it's a good thing. It's just, That's why you it's, it's just to make the, the, I don't know, just to, you know how it would That's be. That's fine, You know, just like the same way men would consume something to make themselves, yes. mm-hmm. you know, have a better mm-hmm. erection or whatever mm-hmm. it is. It, it's, maybe I, it's I don't equivalent. think there's anything wrong with Kunisa Umozi. As long as there's no dark things used. I, correct yeah, me, because no. I'm not, if you're not using a dark force, it's not a force. There's it's just that wrong. whatever okay. you are inserting in your vagina. That's why I need to asil with a You want me to call you all the time and you put a... Okay, let me not say it. Ah. <laughs> say it. <laughs> yeah. I no, I'll fuck your phone up there, you know. Cool, Pimanj. I want to make a look at queen. Am I passing Am I passing Jean? Yeah. Am I passing Jean? But on the real though, yeah. like... On the real. Is there anything wrong with protecting your space and your things 
If your partner doesn't know about it, guys, that's witchcraft. Yeah, Come actually. on now. And it, invo- and it implicates them. Ah. Yeah. What if, so yeah. you're, ta- you're taking the blue pill, a simple, you're, you're popping the blue pill. I don't know about it, mm. right? All of a sudden, I'm surprised at this erection and it's becoming harder every time and more painful every time. So without communicating with me, you're creating a vacuum in our relationship for me to draw my own assumptions. Yeah, that's See true. what I mean? Mm. Assumptions are very dangerous in any form of relationship, be it professional, romantic, you name it. So if you're not communicating and I'm not exposed, I draw my own assumptions. Then I start acting differently because you're different. But your difference and your journey of trying to be different could have been communicated. That babe, Mina, I think in your shawla. You understand? You can have these conversations with your partner. Yeah. To say, I think in your shawla. It's not even like you've got a partner. This is just random people you meet. Like you're taking the blue pill just so that you can have sex and it's a one night stand. Do you now owe that other person and say, I, I, oh, by the I way, don't think I so. use the blue pill or you know what I mean? I don't think so. I don't think so. Then we must question the intention behind what we are doing because the intention is going to set up your, your, your karmatic circle. His intention is just to then, have sex. Then he must just have sex. But then there's people that have the intention to take blue pills just to get a rah, rape bump. Ah. Jesus I'm Christ. being serious. There's dark people out there. There's people that leave their houses with the intention to fucking rape tonight. <gasps> and they will. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's... That's another. why I say check yourself. I we not bound to see one anymore. Yeah, check your spirit. Yeah. Why you are doing the True. things you're doing. Yep, that's another level. Because it's the truth, though. Yeah, it is the so truth. So people who practice black magic, mm. are they banished by ancestors or are there still some spirits and damagosi that are still with them and that give them even more power? Just like if a hey. doctor does some funny things, they'll take their license. Minamanga Shona, then I'll come back and visit you in a dream jail. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. Look, I, look, I'm just curious. I don't no, know. I'm just curious. And, and, and I, I, like that, I like that yeah. about yeah. you. you know? yeah. We need more people. If you don't know stuff, you don't know. Uh, I was, I was. Yeah, I no know. one can know everything. You know what I mean? Yeah. No one. So thank yeah. you for that answer, though. Hmm. I don't know. I have to die and come back for that one. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's crazy. No, I'm kidding. I, I then. And I, I like that. So remember you told us about Kifdi, I think the two weeks ago. The guy who was being arrested for um, killing Tupac. Yes, finally. Yes, yeah, yeah. Being Do you part kn- of his murder, yeah. Yeah. Do you know that apparently he has said that it was P. Diddy who paid him or sent him? So there's a yeah. whole rumor right now, allegedly, that. So it's it's about to unfold. So it? Diddy could be going to prison. I don't know. Like, it's just, it's a shocker. Like, yes, Diddy was... Um, there in that time, you mm. know, in that whole era. Yeah, and there was a beef, era. remember? There was, there was a, a beef. beef, yeah. And remember, I mean, even that this song uh, 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 um, hit him up. I mean, yep. Kamba, and he swears at them like, fuck Hick, the bad boys and everything else. So there was intention and a motive, <sighs> definitely. Uh, so, oh, go on, if you guys, I mean, if you bulele, bulele, you know what I mean? Like, but how what can you say? Like, oh, go on. Bye. So, would we, 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 we cancel Didi, really? If Diddy is behind a murder, Tupac's I'm... murder, but can, can I what do you mean? What do you mean cancel? I just want to ask: Is and I, I acknowledge Diddy. Mm-hmm. I really do. Mm-hmm. I really do. I'm asking as a South African. Are you a fan of Diddy? I acknowledge him. Okay. I love him, and I love how so relaxed he is right now in his season. Mm-hmm. Right, he's like enjoying his money, he's living his oh, life, yeah. and I love the fact that he loves Yanos. That's even better. Shout out to Diddy. Shout out to Diddy. But uh, if he were to run the risk of being cancelled for being involved in a Puck murder, let's look at fan base and who's invested in who. Fans are invested in Puck. Mm. And that story and solving that case. Are people going to cry that Diddy's getting cancelled? Mm, no. I don't see majority people crying that Diddy's getting cancelled. Yeah. Uh-uh. Yeah. And I love Diddy. The puck love is too deep. Uh, that puck love. And yeah. also that's just, it's like the Senzo Mewa trial. It's like you're waiting so many years for this trial to be resolved. Yeah. You want it to be resolved. There must be a resolution. Let's, People let's find out who killed anything. Puck. Yeah. Who killed Puck? Yeah. Who killed Senzo? Oof. See what I mean? Who killed AKA? Let's, let's hey, get man. to the bottom of it. Hey, Ooh. man. Tibbs, you know, I mean. Tibbs, yeah. man. Somebody who killed. Ooh. You understand? There's oh, that, man. Who killed these Ooh. people? So there's an investment of emotions and people and the story getting solved. Mm. And if he's the man at the end of this of, of the 
the resolve. Hey. Could it be true? Oh, I wonder. Yeah. I mean, I still say, you know. The judge will say, bad boy for life. <laughs> Sent away. <laughs> With the camera. Yeah, man, like, it is what it is, guys. You know, murder is something. Murder is murder, man. Like, yo, you know? Murder is a but, well, yeah, But I will never judge someone if they still listen to Diddy's music and stuff. Because music is music. And if someone makes a song, and this song reminds me of my ninth birthday, or it takes me somewhere special, or it gives me some sense of healing, and then it's revealed that that person committed something, you know, and, and hurt someone or killed someone, how that song speaks to that person, I can't judge them. You know what I mean? Because when they consumed that music, they didn't know that this guy has done this or is going to do this, you know? So there's also a separation of emotions. For me, when it comes to someone who is now revealed to have done something awful and they also created work that connects with you spiritually, mm. you know? So, yeah. I'm with you on this one. And I think it also speaks to saying all things are resolved in death and all things are forgiven in death. Death is like separation, right? And if you're saying you have to separate your emotions, so this person has done that thing, but they've created this piece of art. Which I've long loved. Yeah, which you've long loved. There is that, okay, I'm just finding this out. Oh, that's disappointing. Oh, but this redeems him. Nah, doesn't redeem. Doesn't redeem this him. lives on its own. Okay. It's, it's art. It's, okay. it's, you know what I mean? It lives on, uh, okay. on its own. Like, okay. Man, it's just that I don't, I'm I not a big you. Diddy yeah. guy, you know, or a big R. Kelly guy. I'm, I don't really have songs that are very close to me, you know? Mm -hmm. But let's say a song like Munewa, Love More Than You. I really love her song. Yeah, you, you do know? like that song. Yeah. Or a lot of Strava's songs. Yeah. Yes, Strava, yeah, you know? Strava, you a lot of Strava's yeah. music carried me, man, through the, the darkest periods ever. Mm -hmm. It would be very difficult for me if Strava now is found to have killed Tupac. You know what I mean? It's going to be very difficult for me because the music for me is as... He, some songs are my safe space and they connect with me spiritually so it's very different you know what i mean so that's why it's it's always weird you know so when we say we are canceling uh someone mm. you know what i mean uh legally they must pay f you know the the for the for their actions uh mm. but the Time music the is crime. something else also you know the music is and i'm saying radio must play it or what i'm just saying between an individual and the music. It's a mm. personal relationship. You know, I understand radio stations not playing uh, uh, a Briggs or not playing an R. Kelly or if Diddy's found to have killed someone, not because he's a murderer. Cool. Mm. But I won't judge people who still engage, engage. with the work. I get you. Hmm. I, that's a peaceful way of living, eh? Yeah. In your head and in your heart, it's peaceful. Yeah. Ish. Yeah. Mm. Hectic. Mm. But you know, um, you guys mentioned in that um, murder chat about. Um, also, Senzo. Remember recently, oh, Kelly Kumalo, there was a whole rumor that Netflix was offering I Kelly. I saw 22, yeah, 22 million. Yeah, 22 million. Yeah, yeah. So, no, Netflix has denied it. So just oh, have to, they? Yeah. Yeah, but also the sister, it. Uzandi, came out on her Instagram. I saw, I think, yesterday or day before yesterday, she had mentioned that she put that picture up of the headline. Yeah. <clears throat> and then in a, quite a long caption, I didn't read all of it, but yeah. I got the gist of it. She was saying that she surprised that she always stumbles upon information about her life that she doesn't know no of. of. Oh. You understand? It's fake news. So that was like, okay. that clarified it. Yeah. Like, I, that squashed that rumor. <sighs> yeah. But how would you guys, because obviously it would be very irresponsible for Netflix to give them such a deal before the case is concluded. Yay. Right? I but don't think now, so. I don't think so. No, no, I don't be, think so. No, no. Because why I'm saying before oh. it's concluded, I'm saying before we know what happened, who's guilty, who's an accomplice in the murder. Because at the moment, we don't know much. I, I, right? I, I'm, still, I'm still in disagreement with you. I, I think as a content creator, as a content producer, you're always on the sideline for the next big drop. Oh, yeah. You understand? I so whether, you. whether they are innocent, whether they are guilty, whether we end up... No, wh whichever way the conclusion of the case goes, there's still a story to be told there. A big story to be told there. Okay, so... Yeah. Rose Marinko was in prison, right? Yeah. During her case, if Netflix went to her and said, sell us your story. Yeah. Ne? And then the verdict is that she's guilty and she murdered a, a numerous number of people. Yeah. Wouldn't it be responsible for them to enrich her after she's taken lives and enrich her for her story of taking lives, her particularly? 
Because the story, they could always pay somebody else who's part of the story from their vantage point, and they weren't responsible for the loss of life. That's why I said it's irresponsible. If, I get if, you. if the case is wrapped and we know who the murder is, we know who was involved, and it's not Kaylee, it's not Zandi, yeah, let them sell the story. You know what I mean? I and maybe, you. and hopefully Senzo's family gets something as well. I get so you. So that's what I meant. I get you a lot. Yeah, yeah I get yeah, you yeah. a lot, yeah. So, I get but you. It's not a true story anyway, so. Yeah. I mean, it's fake news. But I thought it was fake news. Yo. Fact checker. Oh, I'm so sorry. Sorry, please. How are you doing? I was looking at you. I was thinking. Oh. Um, just to give you context, um, remember that last year Netflix had released a documentary that's yes. still going on. So I'm not stating that the allegations are true. It has been ruled out that they are rumors. However, it could have been a link or whoever wrote that false um, information could have linked it to the documentary that was sent out last year. How oh. late so? Late so. so wait, we, wait, I'm, I'm lost. So the, late. What documentary? The, the sense of yeah, documentary. The sense yes. of sense of sense. What about it? It was released by Netflix. Yes, yes, I remember. Content. I've seen it. So what if they are stating that that all has a link? But I'm not stating that it's that, true. That that money was. It couldn't have been because. Couldn't have been. Yeah. It's too late. It's, it's yeah, and also Kelly was she, was she was not on that docu, was she? No. Yeah, so she couldn't have been paid for something she's not on. You know what I mean? Because also she doesn't own the story. And also story the docu of... was so premature. Yeah, yeah that docu was that docu but, was yeah, way premature. Way, like I said, way, way, way. way, way those premature. content creators were super excited and way trigger happy. Yeah. They could have just chilled. Yo, 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 yo. Way yo. They could have chilled. Because we don't have yeah. all the facts. We don't even know the verdict. But it's we don't that even know what example you made you know, about um, how, obviously, as a, someone, an exec there at Netflix, they're just looking for content. It's like, oh, this is a good story. You want to invest. Yeah. I think you want to invest. You want to be on the sidelines looking out for what could possibly work. Yeah. That's your role as a gambler in yeah. an executive position. Yeah. Especially in, in, in TV. See what I mean? Mm -hmm. You are supposed to constantly look forward to where the money is coming from. Mm. And if you have a hot concept that can attract advertisers, you're winning because it's eyeballs and advertisers, yep. eyeballs and advertisers. So they, they are always hot and heavy for it. Hmm. Always sitting on the edge of the seat. What's new? What's fresh? What can we possibly yeah. do? See have I mean? you guys been affected by um, the water crisis? You stay in Johannesburg. I do. We are affected by the water crisis, actually. There was a change in my geezer. I don't know. Are they managing the temperature of our geezers? Uh, I, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. For real, what changed yeah. in your geezer? So, so I don't know. I don't know. Well, um, it, uh, my geezer used to be able to hold like w hot water long term, like mm. for all of us in the house to do like the mm -hmm. school run, the yeah. early morning yeah, run, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. See what I mean? Ready, uh -huh. And it's my, it's the people getting ready in my household are only three people. Yeah. It's my 13 year old son, my. Ten-year-old daughter, myself. Guys, I'm she saw you. After two people, oh, ha, the first one. You <gasps> know, we, oh. we we shower short, short, hey. Yeah. And no one. I'm militant about the water. Like quick, fast shower. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Ayapela, manza, she saw you. And then sudden X, like it's not uh, uh, um, close by the geezer. It's not just like anyone can access it within your household. No, no, no. Uh, no absolutely see. not. Yeah, absolutely not. Absolutely not. And check it out if they are not. That is crazy, if not, man. If, if they're not managing our geezers in some way or the other. Whoa. That would if, be To hectic. manage electricity usage. Yeah. I've gotten somebody in. Oh, it's fine. I'm not going to phone you long about Just tell her I want that. Just tell her I want that. I was engaging with you before. No, I'm not telling her I want that. But in terms of the water problems there, I've not experienced major, major water problems. Because people are experiencing water shedding and some people in yeah, the house of Johannesburg have, have not had water for the past, like, I think almost over 50 days. <gasps> No, that's, that's which inhumane. part of Joburg? Yeah, that's inhumane. Eh? Which part of Joburg? Can we check on that? Yeah, please. No, that's crazy. That's I, I saw a strike happening. Like people had even closed off because it was like, okay, this area they closed off the roads that's just wild. because they are paying their levies, their rates and taxes, but they are not getting water. I think I saw images on social media. I can't remember. I didn't read captions or anything, so they were really out of context. Like the South Hills, if I'm not mistaken. Is I it something like South Hills? I, I wonder. Find it. There were yeah. these ladies that were also like on strike. Yes, ma'am. We've got something. Okay, to answer you, I'm not exactly sure if it has anything to do with your geezer specifically. However, ESCOM has made plans on the 28th of September to actually control 
some sort of but test <laughs> <laughs> oh damn I'm, I'm telling you i'm telling you guys i'm saying i'm telling you I, i've been standing there in my house and i'm like they've they've penetrated us <laughs> they are here <laughs> they are here However, in my shower i'm like i can i can uh, feel them yeah. they are controlling my favorite thing <laughs> it's so upsetting they're doing that however it's been stated that it's going to be implemented in four ways so mm. it's a program that i'm so close to, to four ways they're testing on me i'm a guinea pig what i so swear you... we're the guinea pig area because i'm i think i think i live about 20 25 minutes away from four ways that's a close radius right yeah yeah, yeah. and it's like lesser when there's no traffic yeah yeah so it's about two, in traffic it's about 20 25 minutes out of traffic it's about 15 20 minutes So it's close enough. Right? How, yeah, how do they, I feel how like I'm a guinea pig. Tap on the Giza specifically. I don't know how they're going to regulate it's like, it. It's like saying, oh, they, they are literally changing my pool water level. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like how are they able to get to my pool water level? Know. You know? I don't know. Ah, That's another guys, level of engineering. On, yeah, it's another so level. So how are they, they going to do this? In four ways. Okay, so there's... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> a program. That went over my head. Wait. <laughs> okay, you have to deliver. Said, right? <laughs> <laughs> you have to deliver the always... steps now, so <laughs> you, you've started something here. <laughs> Just to give you guys a little bit more clearly, this yeah. is from the Daily Investor. It was published on the 28th of September, 2023. So what's happening is they want to implement something like a smart meter, which controls mm -hmm. household electricity the consumption for it. Mm -hmm. So in some way, that will affect your geysers or your lights and etc. cetera. Okay, in we have house. installed a, a new smart meter. Because so. also with the load shedding, it could be that there's load shedding maybe. I'm not a man, man, load shedding, no more boy, you okay. As I see someone, especially because no one has been using them. Mm. So I, was, I thought maybe it's because... I think it's the solar system probably. probably. Oh. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. The yeah, because petri. People, yeah. Yeah, because people and will take it out things. of context. No, because we just had it installed. <laughs> no, 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 it's fine, yeah. We just had it installed. And mm. in all honesty, you must be careful with those things, hey, because like my, my, my electricity has been trippy and a little bit weird. And there's been... It might be it. And there's mm. been a change in my geezer performance. Mm. It might be it. It oh. might be it. Okay. Yeah. Because they have to physically be there then in order to temper with it. Nobody's visited me with a smartphone. Yeah, I don't know what could be happening there. I don't know, but it's so sad. People don't have water, man. That's fifty mad. days, guys. Yeah. Well, yeah. Done, guys. Twenty twenty four. Make a show routine. Register in go voters rolling voting. Yeah. But we have to tell the truth, guys. Our grandmothers are holding the country back. Hey. No, but no, I, no, 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 Mm -hmm. Ah, guys. Yeah, I want to talk. I want to talk about the people who want to vote. About vote to whoever they want to vote. Mm -hmm. It's census. I didn't even know there was a census last year. Yeah. Right. Um, but Bali le when I saw. Oh, I put him in a an exercise. So, ang balik. <laughs> so, abang balang. So, it's in to answer you. Uh, no, explain, um, listen. <laughs> the, main, the average age of a South African, I think it's 28. Yeah. From the census, the stats from the census. Meaning, we have more people who are young than yep. old in the country. So, the, those young people need to get the fuck out of their seats, their homes, go register to vote and vote. Not vote on Twitter, not vote on Facebook, not vote... Anywhere else, on podcasts, anywhere else, go to the polling stations and vote. And vote. The old people can vote yeah. for whoever they want. But if the majority were on the voters' roll vote, then the old people won't have their way. So let's blame the young people. Yeah, okay. so I disagree with you, Okay, it's cool. Like, I it's feel cool. like I, it's the next year, especially next year, we can never, ever say that. Start, start again. saying that. Because it's about us, the young, or even there's even yeah. more younger, younger people yeah. who can vote right now. I can respect that. I can respect that. So, But which, I get what which, you mean. Yeah. The old people, their minds are... They're my old minds, you yeah. know what I mean? We're young, let's go register and vote. We trump, by numbers, we trump them anyway. So, so we can register to the, vote. The voting age is what? From 16, right? 
18. A, a, from 18, yeah, from 18. From 18, from 18. imagine. 18. How many are uh, So my thing is, okay, cool, we can register to vote, right? There's also... Two thousands can vote. I want to I I open it. No, 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 we can. Um, so I want to check some, I want to check some stuff here. Um, hold on a sec. Um, <clears throat> when we register to vote, there are many people on voting day that get distracted by many things, right? So there are, uh, I want to open this and I want to get this. Okay. Before, while you look at that, fact yeah, checker, fact please checker. check how yeah. do I register to vote? So that I think we can share that. It's pointless saying people must go yeah. register and not tell them how. Yeah, how to vote. So while they're still here, let's just give them that information. I wish there well. could be easier ways. Can't you now even register through some websites, even online? Can you? Oh, is no. there no app to register Guys, to let's vote? Put the link. No, 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 this, no, it's not online. Let's put the link on okay, our. Yeah. Yeah, now you link your vote. Yeah, put a uh, funny link, guys. Nah, yeah, put the link, put the link, put the link, please, to vote. Thank you. Please go vote. You're crazy. And also, when you do register to vote, like, don't get distracted at the end of the day, man. Like, w when it's time to vote, you know, I don't. don't think people, will, man. Pe people do, because there's things like funerals, you know? Oh. That, you know, there's things like um, family events that fall on certain days on those on that particular day. Oh. Then there's things like work commitments. That's how people. That's how people fall off. You know, so we'll have a high. Uh, we'll have a high regi voter registration, but then on the actual voting day, the numbers don't balance. So the voting equation doesn't balance. So there's mm. different reasons why people will fall off the wagon to vote. But for those... Can we hear those reasons? Yeah, yeah. This uh -huh. is the document that I'm looking for. This uh -huh. is what I'm trying to find. Ah. Uh, I... Okay, she's got some facts while there you're still go. searching. <laughs> Good to answer the whole question of at what age you can start registering to vote at the age of 16. Mm -hmm. However, you're only eligible to vote from the age of 18. And then you can vote, can vote online via emails or you can go directly to Ah, man, you can't vote by email, guys. <laughs> you, I'm, I'm not no, voting. No. Register. Register. Apologies. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm so sorry. 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 I'm so Oh, via email, what's the email? Are you going to put, we'll put every, what, are you going to put the email? What's the email? You can register via email, guys. The, That's. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, like, just put the email yeah. then, you know. Let's, yeah, let's people, help the chillers. And then least. how do you check if you're, vote, you're on the voters' roll? I know there's a short code SMS. In my time, I used to check and. Yes, they do send you an SMS. Okay, well, we'll wait till you... F I think it's very important yeah. till you find it, you know. Dini, are you winning with the, the document? Oh, man, I can't find it. Because I'd love to see I that. can't find it. I'll, keep, yeah. I'll come back to it. I'll circle back to yeah, it. Yeah, but that's for Dini. Can you, any we have ghost to. lady, any other stories you have? Some kind, you know? I'm just... I'm, I'm kind. Who are we voting for, though? I think that's a big issue. Oh. All right, guys. My name and my parties, they've made their case. Okay. You know, we can't say, hey, I'm by no vote, Telus Banban. Can we say, please consider it? Who like, do you pay my? You, you can share who you're voting who you for. No, 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 no. I'm just saying, can we at least, if we're not going to be saying, okay, we, we obviously we can't say, go vote for this person. We're not, we're not, we're not campaigning for people. Yeah, yeah, right? let's not, yeah. But can we put emphasis on the fact that it's important to put good consideration into who you're voting for? Mm. On, like on, serious, serious consideration. You know, on Popcorn and Cheese, um, the guys chatted to um, one of the leaders in um, Rise Mzansi. Yeah. And like listening to their, you know, everything that they're all about. And I was like, you know what? This is this is something that is good to vote for, yeah. you know? So yeah. it's just those consider like thinking beyond. It's nice to not just only know of the options of EFF, ANC, mm -hmm. you know, DA. There are other options. Yeah, there's Gaten, Patriotic yes, Alliance. Patriotic there is Alliance. Action is but they part of the moonshot pack Sometimes, with DA, yeah, IFP. Thank you. There's IFP, there is EFF. I mean, they EFF is very popular amongst the youth in campuses. Um, so yeah, guys, everybody's got their manifestos up. Exactly. Decide and vote. Just vote. So it's just know? nice. Like invest, take some time, yeah. check out other parties, listen to them and see all their Ooh. here's that thing. I found it. Uh -huh. Okay. So these are um, challenges and reflections, right? Uh -huh. From the 2019 elections. Okay. No? Um, 
we've got here. Eligible voters, we had 35.9 million. So that's people on the voters' roll. Yeah. Who had registered. Registered, 26.75. Okay, okay. Oh, no, no, no. Oh. Sorry, my bad. Eligible is Eligible. anyone over, over 18, 18. Over 18. Oh, South yeah. African. Yes. Ah. Okay, okay, sorry, my bad. Actual votes, and this is my thing. And the voters' see, roll listen is? to the registration. You said the right? voters' ro- the registered <clears throat> voters' Registered vote? voters are 26.75 million. Okay. okay. Right. Actual votes, look at this margin. It's freaking crazy. The people who walked in. Who walked in and To the polls the and, do and had the black indelible marks. 100%. On their thumbs. 17.67 million. Uh. Out of 26.75 registrations. Voters. Yeah, that's okay, why. So that's almost like 10 million people who got then, distracted or who couldn't make it. Yeah. No, man, that's yeah. like 4 million. No, 17 from 26. From, like, from 26. 26. 26. Yeah. From 26 yeah. million. That's a big number. Yeah, a big number. Sorry, my bad. That's a big thank number. Thank you, thank you. And then we've got here, we've got 6 million unregistered individuals that were younger than 30. We've touched on this, right? Okay. The young mm-hmm. ones. 6 million under 30 yeah. didn't register? No. Unregistered, yes, you're correct, uh-huh. you're correct. Wow. Of the 17.6 million people who voted, 10 million voted for the ANC. Oh. Okay. 66% turnout down from 73.4% turnout in 2014. Mm. And this is where we're sitting. My concern is we make the commitment, but we don't follow through. We don't follow through. That's why I'm saying put emphasis on when we are registered to vote. Let's keep the momentum within us. Okay. Let's like be in the, that mindset of engaging in our with our country current affairs at that level. That when it's time to vote, there's nothing that can kill that fire. So because I, change look, must come. Even if they don't engage current affairs, they can see it in their daily lives. Mm. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm. And if I want to span it, to pay three fifty from government, that should already tell yeah. you. Even if I was in that current state of affairs, yeah. you just know that we've got a government who are ruled. And this is my reality. So yeah. I think that alone yeah. is motivation to 100%. go out there and, 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 and vote, you know? 100%. If you're happy with how things are, continue voting how you vote or been voting. If you're not, vote for somebody else. Like, mm. you decide who you want to vote for. Is it also maybe the time frame? Remember when you register, the momentum of register, register, register to vote, and everyone is like, oh. Then by the time voting happens, it's like maybe the, the drive now or the thing of saying, guys, go and vote is not as, you know, it doesn't match the time when it was go register. So maybe also there's a fault there. And mm-hmm. I think we must keep the, and I agree, the momentum must be, it's like, okay, now that we've registered and those stats must come out and say three, um, 30 million people, if let's say 30 million people have registered to vote, make sure all love you. So there's almost like there's another campaign mm-hmm. that happens to make sure it's like, you know, that you are, you are one in 30 million who have registered, go make your mark now. Uh, it's, this is uh, the next step to make. Uh, yeah. So I vote again. That's all again. I vote in. I vote in. Thank God. I vote the first. Do you know that Will Smith mm-hmm. has been separated from Jada? He ruined his life for this woman. Um, trying to defend her name. They've been separated for seven years. She said now in an interview. Oh no! How I mean, weak I, is I that? Don't even know <laughs> that? How weak? Yeah. Yeah. Like, uh, how weak? Like, like I, like, I, I will. No, no, no. I, mean, I, I feel like he deserves it because him. you pretended. Like you say, pretend. So you see what pretend does. Of course, for you the start world. Overreacting. A show. You start overreacting. That's what happens. Uh huh. I feel like okay. Yeah. Now my take with this, yeah, 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 Jada and Will is that w- what Will is going through is not necessarily a unique case. How many people can share the same story given an opportunity mm. um, and tell you that they've invested? So much of themselves in a person that they believed they were building with, that they believed loved them the same way. I think as human beings, we make the simple mistake of expecting ourselves from other people. You know, like how we love, we expect that and that loyalty. And we expect it to be reciprocated. To be reciprocated. Many human beings can tell you the same Jada and Will story. Yeah. Like at the end of really investing yourself, all you have at the end of the day as a thank you card is just a shit show. And it hurts. It it really hurts. Women mostly. Women mostly. Um, and sometimes, like the, the ladies yeah. who get hit, some you know, uh, 
quite a num- numerous times abused. Well, I'm one of them, yeah. Cheated on, damn. Yeah, I'm one of them. I've been hit. Yeah, sorry. But you found a way to leave. Yeah, you, you know, Some yeah. people still remain. Some people stay. That's because they've given, this is yeah. all they know. They've given yeah. their whole life to this thing. And the guy still just keeps on uh, being messed up, man. Jada is just, she reeks of toxicity. I don't want to lie. And I found it interesting that your opinion on the matter is to say that Will is weak. Um, I'm interested to know why you would describe She's it repeatedly as humiliated him in public. I mean, she will give an interview and still mull and cry over Tupac or whatever. She's repeatedly, even with af- post this hitting thing, yeah. they should said something. Please check for me something like. Uh, what, was there was there physical abuse in the relationship? I don't know. I've never seen any reported. I've never seen any articles on, and I've been invested in their relationship yeah. at some point. Um, are you saying he's Man, weak because of his gender? Kid. But are you saying August, he's weak? August, August. No. Yes. Oh, but are you are you saying he's weak because he's a man? Him. Are you saying he's weak because he's a man? No, because dude, you're in a in a situation whereby this person is toxic and has repeatedly betrayed. Because uh, uh, if they've been separated for seven years, yeah, right? Yeah. I get that. Yeah. Ne? And maybe they've got a deal of let's do this, let's do th- th- that. It's fine. You can sleep with whoever you can. Mm-hmm. But she doesn't seem to have tried to even keep it between the two of them because it's always coming out that, ah, oh, she's saying X and Y. She slept with so and so and so. Meanwhile, we was still there. To the point where he, dude, you've separated from this person. Why would you walk up to a person and slap a a, a Chris Rock and put your career on the line, which subsequently has teka teka, Mm -hmm. you know, for this person who you've been separated from. And just the other time she was sleeping with your son's friend. How did she announce it? What was it? What was it's an it? interview. What? It's an out interview. there. Yeah, okay. go check it out. It's, on, right. it's it like online. Is it a visual interview or yeah. just an article Q&A? Nah, visual, visual interview. Fact checker, please give them the facts. Um, she broke the news on People's Magazine on an interview that she's having with People's Magazine. Is it? Okay. Yes. So she did state that they are not divorced, but they have been separated for approximately 67 years. Mm-hmm. But I think, so I, think- I, I think it has nothing to do with any of us, though. I mean, just think about it. How are we faffing over the intricate personal details of two human beings that have decided they're doing life together? That's their problem. Because like, where are we? But one, the, it's got nothing to do with us. Ah, but come on, guys. It, yeah, to a certain extent. But remember, all of this thing has always unfolded in front of us. This is true. So we are kind of invested in everything that happens in that relationship. You this know, is we speak so openly of whatever that's hope happening. You know, mm. for therefore it's like when you speak out, you obviously you must be re- waiting there for mm. whatever opinions that people of are going to say. Of course. And at the end of the day, I feel like with them also, there's two ways. Mm-hmm. Well, they had two dis- they had decisions, right? They made and said, okay, maybe they were protecting the family. Mm-hmm. Like, let's protect our kids. Let's stay together. Because you remember those dynamics of how people will still be together. Let's still mm-hmm. pose, you know, out there as a couple, as a husband and wife. So, but now to, that's why I just, I want to l- listen to this thing and see, because I don't yeah. know the whole announcement of the seven years, but I'm just speculating yeah. on what could be... What the dynamics yeah. might be. What if it's a simple case of two individuals that have removed their emotions from the situation, they haven't moved on to other romantic partners, but they've decided, we have decided that we're going to monetize our relationship and our union, and we've built this empire. Mm. Now we're just going to run a business. So if And it's a content... They're running a content empire on their own life story. Yeah. See what I mean? So if they haven't, what if it's just that simple? What if they haven't moved on to other romantic partners? And and now in this separation, well, there's nothing they to just, appreciate. They just hide it. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. Because we don't know the details, guys. Yeah, yeah true. We don't know. I'm just, we maybe I'm a disgruntled uh, Will Smith fan because I'm like, damn, now I'm going to be deprived of Will Smith because he decided to defend the honor of Jada but they've long uh, separated. And I, it's I the think mother of his children. Moved. Maybe that's what it's It's just, I'm just defending my, the mother of my children. Or maybe you were just uh, okay, projecting. That's a good point. Maybe you're just projecting from a place of knowing that within you, you would not be able to handle and tolerate such embarrassment. 
Maybe it's embarrassing for you, but maybe he's not embarrassed. Maybe he's yeah, like, yo, that's that. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe you're projecting because it, it makes you feel uncomfortable. He's, they seem to be okay with it. Maybe we're just projecting ourselves on them. Maybe, but because I can't, I can't imagine myself in a relationship like that. So I would probably have something not so positive to say about that setup. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I'm projecting, see, yes. because I can't imagine myself Self in like that situation. Yeah, yeah, in that situation. I could so maybe never separate from That's why maybe you say weak. And, and play pretense. And play pretend. It's wild. I, I can't. Best life I can't. Live it publicly. So we are projecting. Yeah. Because we can't see ourselves doing that. Yeah. 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 I can't. Yeah. I don't want to lie, man. Yeah. And even if I do agree to it, ah, and I don't think so. <laughs> I guess it lasts. I don't think I'll be at the Grammys, <laughs> at the Oscars, you know. Walling out like Will Smith did, you yeah, know what that I mean? Was crazy. Uh, but you make a valid point that she is a mother, after all, of his children. Yeah. And his kids are watching that going, Dad, aren't you gonna do some or say something? Yeah. You see, I would have said something. Maybe not a slap, because uh, yeah. you have to be tactful as well. On any other day, someone says anything about my family members at a bride, they can catch hands. But at the Oscars, maybe not. I'd be more tactful. You know what I mean? Bro, and so I maybe there was nothing also... to no tactics to even be practiced for me. There was no nothing to be practiced there. Just laugh along. Ha ha ha. Okay, move I'm on. I'm sorry, but I've thrown ice buckets at people for, for speaking badly on my kids, my family. I've thrown ice buckets. Sometimes oh. things do get violent. I even put a video out to say, I am fucking Will Smith. I'll fuck you up. Mm. Like now we'll handle it. Ooh. Like, don't come at my family yeah, like that. Yeah, we've seen you, Dineo. We've don't seen come you. at my family like that. Like, don't. <laughs> like, please don't. You don't yeah, know us. Man. You're not part of us. Mm -hmm. Don't get involved with us. Just be a spectator. Keep it moving. Like, don't come at us. Don't. Hmm. I don't ask you to run a car over them. Yeah. And I like and I like because... If they fuck with <laughs> yes. your family, she'll run a car over you. <laughs> What's next? Um, big ups to uh, Tyler. Her, she got nominated. No, no, not nominated, but her. Tyler Water. No, no. Yeah. Which? Yes. Water. Yes. Oh, for Water. water. Yes. Yes. Uh, yes. Yes. Uh, 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 yeah, love that water, song. Yeah. You love that song. Love that song. So she got. Um, uh, she she made it to the Billboard Top 100, and this is after Miriam Makeba. It was the last um, late South African woman to be there was Miriam Makeba, and this was like 50 years ago, over 50 years ago. It was ago. Brahu Masigela for Crazy the Cross. So no, but female, that female. Is so oh, female. Yeah, she's the okay, yeah. The first, love, the first was yeah, yeah, yeah. For oh, water. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Yes. It's, for this it's, song. Yes, for what? For this song. Yes. yes. That, and she made it. Awesome. Yeah. That's crazy, right? She made it. That's bloody. For water. Yes. Wow. Yeah, shout out to Tyler. That's such man. a Beautiful. bloody. Shout out to Tyler. That's amazing. Man. Where's the knife on it? That, that is, is yeah. massive. And that is more. massive. Oh, and you know, <laughs> that's bloody dope. <laughs> shout that's out to bloody Tyler. dope. Yeah, that's yeah. beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Is this where we call it a rap? I think yes. so. I, I think, think so too. We're it ending it on a high note and with Tyler. Shout out, shout out to Black Coffee as well. History. Yeah. History. Yeah. History. History. Madison Garden Square. Yeah. This late, yeah. I can't wait for Mac. Uh, sorry. Mac has come back. Is Mac calling? Bring, 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 bring. <laughs> We How are we going to do up. this? Are we going yeah. to connect him or should no, we? No, on speaker. Just loudspeaker him. Hey, I'm going. Enda, 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 enda. Yeah, who the chill is here, bro? We we still shooting the show. What's going on, bro, in New York? Oh, I just landed, dog. I was just landed. Landed where? Oh, I'm in Ortumbo. Oh, wow. Oh. Yeah, I'm in Ortumbo. All right, cool, man. All right, you wanted to say something? No, no, no. Judy said I'm a caller. She sent me a voice note saying I'm a caller, so that's why I'm calling. I think. Oh, I'm okay, yeah, yeah. No, you'll update us when you get back, man, you know, about New York and all. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Nice one, famo. Oh, Mac is not even prepared. He's oh, thinking. Shame. He sounds so tired. Oh, there's a oh, yeah. shame. Oh, there's he a, yeah, he's, tired. he's tired, Shem. Yeah. It was a personal so we're, thing. We're, we're literally like wrapping up on two high notes because also him. I'm happy for him for like this progressive Ooh. way of working of his. It's just yeah, absolutely man, like, fucking oh, phenomenal. Bro, like, it's so amazing on, to on, watch. On Tyler on things. Um, Charlemagne the Guard we posted. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, think, Together. Yeah, that was like, yeah. if, uh, when I saw that, People I was like, really oh. idiots. And he's on yeah. their podcast, right? Yeah. Bro. Really oh. I was like, I wow. It. It's amazing. Mm. It's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. I love it. All of it. 
can't yeah. wait. Lini, thanks. Yeah. Thank you for Thanks coming for having me. Thank you, you held so it down. Much. I will. Yeah, thank well, you so much. Nice to you meet you. Beautiful. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Chillers, I'm out. Bye. Bye. Before we bounce, yeah. tomorrow I'm dropping a song, guys. Oh, right? wow. Yeah, we're going to play it now. Is this your second drop? Check it for out. The year. Second drop for so, the year. For the year, right? it drops today, now. No, tomorrow. On, tomorrow. Tomorrow, right. today's Thursday. Yes. It drops tomorrow. It's okay. called Lonely Nights. Myself, Anga Tiago, North, oh, Kaso, yes. RSA. Yes. It's going to be a big song, man. Oh, it's yes. going to be a hit. It's a beautiful song, man. It's called Lonely Nights. Nice. Enjoy it. Here's a lyrical video. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Can I please just ride on this, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I ride on yeah, this? Yeah, right, right, Yeah, right, right. yeah. So I'm like disrupting the sneaker game, right? Just go mm. check out my sneaker mm. store. Oh, Anxy.store, A-N-X-Y dot store. Check out if you like it. If you do, cop it. And also this grandeur is nice. I'm out. Thank you. Thank you. Check Bye. it out. Anxy. <laughs>